associated with Makashi form 2 um, and one that's associated with Shicho at the beginning um, and that will be uh, the hut slide versus the hyper jump step and both of them are going to be shown in a kind of Makashi style so all of you studying Makashi out there this one will be of great interest to you. Helping me out today is Brendan so we will uh, get right to it. <clears throat> okay so the, uh, the first part of it is of course stance. So let's assume our stance here. <clears throat> Good. Okay, now, so as we're standing here, you notice that we're both kind of bouncy. Let's move back so we're a little bit more centered. <clears throat> okay, now, as he's standing there, stand there for this. Where he's got a nice kind of lowish stance, it's going to be towards the back of his, the back of his leg. Now, as we're standing here as opponents, we can then distance each other using our hut slide. The hut slide being this little shuffle. So as I shuffle forward, he's going to go back. All right? And we keep a good thing. Now, he's going to come forward, and I'm going to go back. Okay? Now, you see, we can keep a good distance from each other using just this footwork. That's no problem. Okay? Now, what happens is, is sometimes we're going to want to come forward, sometimes we want to go back while attacking, or we actually want to come in here, because right now we can't hit each other. All right? So what I can do is I can take a little bit of a larger step, and at the same time, you can see him already kind of seeing what's happening. I come in, and I do a shim over to that side. He carries it. I do it again. Now, we'll do it again here together. He's going to kind of go back at the same time as I do, right? Each time, I'm going to get a little bit closer. Now, what he can do is he can then reverse it by coming in in the same fashion. Right? Good. Now, we get into a stalemate back up here a little bit. <clears throat> a little bit more. Okay? So we're way out of each other's range. Okay, what we'll use is the hyper jump, jump step. Okay, and that is going to be leaping forward with one foot, bringing the other foot in as to bring the base forward, and then reaching out into a very long lunge. Okay, so <clears throat> we'll go through it here. I'll do it for him, and actually, why don't you back up here a little bit more? so that you're way, way back, and I'll show you how much space it can actually take care of. So if I'm here, I go forward, all the way there. And you can see how much space I actually traverse. It'll be even more impressive with Brendan. If Brendan does that same thing, you see he can cover that, that whole distance very, very quickly, right? Now, sure, when it's isolated, it, it looks obvious. But in a particular, you know, in any type of uh, exchange, things are going to be going very, very fast. And that's going to set and change the rhythm just a little bit, which is going to give your opponent a little bit of a hard time. Okay? Now, the important differences between hut slide, right? When we're doing our hut slide, and actually, Brendan, why don't you, do, why don't you just demonstrate hut sliding forward? These are small. And notice that the feet stay about the same width apart. Good. Okay. Mo when he's going backward, most of the weight's going to be a little bit forward. When he's going forward, weight's going to be a little bit back. Notice also, nice springy stance. Okay. Same thing here. Okay. Now, when he goes and does the jump step, good. His feet come together all the way in the middle. Good. He's out, reaching way out, okay? So this keeps him as far away from the opponent 
as possible. Good, excellent. Recover. And then he recovers all the way back. It's okay to hold out that, hold out this strike. Just remember you're coming right back. And you'll see here, we'll just go through a couple of little exchanges. How that footwork kind of comes in together. So, there you have it. <clears throat> the differences between the hut slide, hyper jump step, how it's used, what it looks like. Uh, we'll go into some practical applications here. So, um, enjoy that. Uh, may the force be with you, and happy sabering. <laughs>